appears to be reinventing himself as Ike Maritz. He released his second album in Cape Town this past week. You'd be forgiven for not recognising Ike Moritz. He's had relative success in the UK as a musician and as an actor, he's played walk-on parts in Love Actually, Bridget Jones 2 and Alfie. I've been a barman on Alfie. Uh, that was a lot of fun. We shot, we shot for like 17 hours and uh, drank about 10 bottles of uh, champagne, I think. <laughs> that was great. I couldn't believe he was so short, eh? Sure. <laughs> But the days of bit parts in British movies are over. After a five-year stint in the UK, he's ready to launch his music career here at home. After being away for four years and really trying it out overseas and really not sticking to the South African thing, and uh, I just realised, you know, this is this is where I belong and uh, this is this is where I love to be. And also, so much has happened here, and it's just um, it's so it's awesome to be back. I mean, I'm. I'm thrilling, I'm really... Um. <laughs> He's worked with George Michael and David Bowie's producer, but Ike says his latest album is a departure from his earlier Brit Rock sound. The energy is great here, I mean, I must say, I mean, the bands I've met so far, the South African bands I've met so far, they're so much more authentic than they used to be. I mean, it's not like we want to sound like some, some guy in, in, in the UK or in America or whatever and, you know, trying to imitate them or something. It's, you know, it's really authentic. Ike's album is in stores this week and he'll be touring the country over the next few months. Thank you. And because his track is called Play Me, we're going to do just that and play out with the sounds of Ike Mart.